Now, people submit their DNA information to 23andMe to find out their family's origin, who they're related to, and any illnesses they're susceptible to because of genetics. Now that information is apparently for sale on the dark web. 23andMe confirmed profile information was taken that includes usernames, passwords, gender, photo, relatives in common, and the percentage of DNA you share with them. It's terrifying, and it's one of those things like this is so new, I can't even like fathom right now what the implications are. If I were a part of that compromise, that I would, I would be freaking out right now. Cybersecurity expert Boyd Kluis tells me how hackers could use this information. Because think about how many password reset questions they have. What's your grandmother's name? What street did you go up, grow up on? That information is actually revealed in those profiles. 23andMe customers submit saliva samples that are sent off to the 23andMe labs where it is matched with other DNA from around the world. It can also be shared with GED Match that can match DNA with people who haven't submitted samples themselves. It's how police caught the Golden State Killer when his DNA was linked from other relatives and to the crime scene 32 years earlier. So is it possible that your DNA information is at risk because someone in your family spit in a tube? Ancestry system that I use, I mean, it shows all of my family that's connected to me because it's ingrained in that profile. And I would, I would definitely say it is very likely that now not only do they have that person's DNA information, but also relatives. And it isn't enough just to change your 23andMe passwords, but for any account where you've used that same password. And Clueless says 23andMe customers should sign up for credit monitoring ASAP. That's what the tech. I'm Jamie Tucker.